I'm just putting uh, some fine detailing in on the fur. And that's basically all I'm going to be doing today. I'm just waiting for Todd, who's gone to West Yellowstone to uh, do a little cross-country skiing, to get back into Anna so that he can take a look at it, uh, you know, critique it, uh, decide whether he likes it or not, or uh, if he wants me to redo the whole damn thing. <laughs> Anyway, um, so that's what I'm going to do today. I was going to start working on my other clay, but that clay is so big and cumbersome to move around all the time. I decided just to work on this for a couple hours until uh, Todd gets here. And uh, so that's what I'm going to do today. I'm not going to show very much of this because... Quite honestly, this kind of detail can quite literally drive you nuts. And if you got to watch it, uh, well, who knows? The mental instability that could be created. <laughs> anyway, that's why I'm uh, just going to video a little bit and... Uh,
Uh, if you would like to uh, learn a little bit more about my instructional DVDs, uh, of which I've got uh, probably a good 50 years of experience packed into these DVDs, um, little tricks, little things you can do uh, in your sculpting, please check out uh, the link in the video description below this video. Also, if you enjoy this video or my videos, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe and then click on the uh, follow uh, button in the subscription. Well, Todd came in and uh, we spent a couple hours working on this uh, clay, trying to get it uh, to where he liked it. He gave final approval on it and uh, he even signed it because he has had a hand in creating it. And then I put my signature into the clay as well with a date. And so we'll be I'll be taking this to the foundry tomorrow, get it uh, started in the process. And uh, I'm happy with it. And so is Todd. It really does reflect what Sam looked like. And uh, it's going to be a good memory of him. All right, everybody. Have a great night. See you next time.